up what up tube street i'm out here at kickapoo state park in danville illinois uh we're on the five five again pretty stoked i've ridden part of this trail uh, maybe three miles previously but i haven't ridden the rest of it i think it's around 11 mile loop so we're gonna hit that up seems to be pretty fun in really good shape so we'll see you on the trail and i almost forgot make sure that you hit that subscribe button down there. Follow me on my adventures. I'm not doing this to make money or anything. I just want to share my life with you people. Okay, getting ready to leave the parking lot here at Kickapoo State Park. This is one of the back lots. I think they have another lot up front. So heading into the trail. Um, I'm gonna stay left right here. It. You're gonna hang a right at this, and I believe that we're on trail five. I don't know, they're all numbered, and they're all on MTV Project. It's a nice phone app to, to uh, find trails that are around. It's a bit brisk out here today. Feels pretty good after you get to riding for a bit. Pretty exhausted, actually. I've been doing pilot trainings. I'm a drone pilot and uh, for a crop insurance company. Been traveling all over the Midwest this week, training pilots on our new software. Tell you what, driving is by far one of the most tiring things that you can do for a job. Major respect for people especially truck drivers, people who travel for a living a lot. Major respect. Fun little G out. Lots of roots. Lots of roots, and man, this is just super. It's rooty, but it's, man, it's flowy. Took pictures here with my uh, of my Mach 4. I'm telling you, fall is in full swing here, and it is gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Man, these trails are just in such good shape. You can tell they've had a little bit of moisture on them. Good old tacky dirt. I can't go over how clean they are. They must have, people must ride here pretty consistently. Ooh. That's fun. We're officially on trail six. I know that it goes right here. Never done this before. So, riding all this blind, but it is what it is. That's straight down. Now this is a, uh, Real off camber. It's sweet, but it's steep. I don't know what's over each little ridge. That's steep. Oh. We're gonna go for it. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh. oh man. Wow. We are not done. Oh yeah. Ooh. 
Ooh, what's this? Okay, trail map. I'm probably gonna go straight. Or right there. I don't know what this is like either. I'm not saying it is yet, but this might be one of my favorite trails I've ever ridden. I'm only three miles in. Gotta figure out where I am first. Check out that view though. View. Beautiful. Oh, that's deep. All right. That's the one we're gonna follow because that's eight. All right. We missed a lot somewhere. <laughs> that's okay. We're gonna go ahead on trail eight because I know this is the direction we're supposed to be riding, so I think I missed trail seven, but I rode enough to, uh, I rode enough extra to make up for it, so I'm not gonna worry about the mileage. Fun little winding section back here on trail eight. Cobblestones. I like it. All right. Made it up that big guy. Hopefully, that's it. Oh my gosh. Come on, baby. Wow. These hills are a bit much. Oh boy. I'm sure there's more. Wow. Oh, who knows if we're going down or up or mountain climbing or what we're doing. I'll see how we can go up anymore. Oh boy. Wow. This is steep. It's like a shoot. Wow, that is insane. This is for sure my favorite place I've ever ridden. I wish I wouldn't have got confused. I should have just stayed on trail six, followed that on up and then it hit trail seven and it winds back down a ways. Uh, man, that's a blast. Holy cow. So now I think we're on uh, fire road for a little bit. Trail nine. Cool. So this is where we enter. Oh. It's out here in mountain goat mode. So many steep up and downs. <laughs> Lots of little ravines. Man. This is beautiful. I think we're going down. Saw some berms. Okay. Ah. Oh boy. Oh. My gosh. I cannot get over how steep everything is here, man. It's awesome. And it seems like there's always an access road or something close. So if you need to get out or if somebody needs to come in and help, they can. Whoa. A little bit of speed up. I feel like we're going down, but don't go. Not in the grass. So I guess you don't need to come out to the road. You can just hang a left onto the onto this other path that meets up with it. It's just flat and fast in here.
Okay. Oh man, such good flow. Such good flow. I think we are. Berms. to pop off of. Oh man, the flow is unreal. Are you going down again? I'm not sure. Sure looks like it. Oh yeah, we are. Oh boy. Yeah, it's getting steep. This just goes to show there's not a whole lot of elevation in Illinois and you can make some really nice trails. Big, big props to Kickapoo State Park for this. I mean, this is amazing. Ooh, steep. Ooh, man, what's this? Like fun. Okay. <laughs> oh, see, climb. <sighs> yeah. It's nice when you can keep your momentum in it. Oh, boy. Three to the right. We just hit trail three. Oh. Tight little section. All right, trail four. I think this is the last one before we get back. Looks like we might be going down, I don't know. Oh boy. There we are. It's a nice little technical bit. Wow. <laughs> there. Really fun. Oh boy. Ooh, a little overlook, that right there is beautiful. All the yellow on the trees, best time of the year. Okay. 
here we are. Back to the beginning. Going back to the parking lot. Man, talk about some awesome riding out here at Kickapoo State Park in Danville, Illinois. I don't think I've ridden any better yet. Like I said, guys, I don't think I've ridden any better trail yet than, uh, than Kickapoo State Park here in Danville, Illinois. Super fast, super flowy, really steep climbs and descents, uh, but it's all worth it. So if you get the chance and you're coming through Danville, Illinois, I would definitely hit it up. I ended up with uh, 9.94 miles of trail today and I skipped out on trail number seven. So that would probably give you your extra mile, mile and a half. So yeah, if you're in the area, hit up Kickapoo State Park in Danville, Illinois. On the other end, thanks for tuning in to The Nice Life again, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace.